everybody, Susie Q here at Q Aquatics. And check out my haul from my summer tubbin. I see a, I see a garami. I did have croaking garamis in this one. Two croaking garamis. Oh my goodness, I got some croaking garamis. That would be good. I am thrilled. I see at least two garamis and I'm 80% positive there's two garamis and the rest look like CPDs. One though, I bet you is a mosquito fish and I'm gonna pull that one out. They all look like CPDs except for those two. So I'm gonna let let the water settle a little bit. Here come the grommy. So this is the tank that this bucket's gonna go in. So first I'm gonna drip acclimate out of here into here until they're used to the water. Then I'll scoop them out with the net and put them in here. Let me start to drip. This is coming on a lot faster than drip acclimating. Hmm, I should probably tie a little knot in it, maybe? It's not a, definitely not a drip acclimate. That's more of a, that would be a drip acclimate. And then I would go outside and get more fish. All right, that's not a drip acclimate. So let me get used to what they got. They just got about half of the amount of water in there. So let me get used to that. There's one fish in here that I took out of that tub in the beginning, and that's exactly what it looks like. They look like, I guess it's a garami. Garami. And there's two garamis in here and nine CPDs, or eight CPDs. That would equal 10, right? Yeah. So here's what I'm thinking for the next round. I have the empty blue tub. I'm gonna start draining the water through a net into the blue tub so that if there's any fish, we'll catch them, but it'll fill the water up It'll fill the tub up with the water from the, the tub that I'm draining. So any fish I catch, which should all be wild guppies, I'll start pulling out, but I gotta pull all those plants out and I'll put them in the first tub. So the first tub that has my white cloud minnows will be filled with all the plants. Gotta think of what to do with the plants. from the second tub I can only imagine that some of these are the parents obviously because some of them are huge but there are a lot of fry in there oh, there's another garami oh my goodness how does that happen I'm thinking because I moved plants back and forth maybe but I can definitely see the baby garami I'm taking that out two garamis oh Look at that. One, two garamis. The rest are all guppies, which is good. And they'll live a beautiful, healthy life in my turtle tanks until they don't, you know. But I'm not gonna put my garamis in there. Oh, I'm so happy. I think we're good. Tub two down. Okay, these guys are drip acclimating. These are the guppies. From that summer tub. And I'm acclimating them to this tank. And they're just gonna be my wild little guppies, my wild childs. Okay. 
So they've been getting used to this water, which is about a third pond and two thirds of this tank. I'm gonna pour it all in here and then just keep changing this water 50% until it's back to regular. Okay, so here's my white cloud minnows. I am so excited about these. Well, we're gonna let it settle for a minute. So these are the white cloud minnows. I am so excited. Wow, some of them are golden, some of them are beautiful blue lines. Now I know I probably could have left this out a little bit longer because they can go a little cooler, but it's gonna get in the 40s for the next few weeks, if not from now on and then colder because it is at the uh, middle October. So I can bring them in now or I can try to do everything I did while it's cold or raining and I, I don't want to do that. So they're coming in now just to see if they want a little bit of bug bites because these guys were awesome. Yeah, they like that. Very thrilled. Okay, so the summer tub and had its ups and had its downs. It was a lot of work and I'm definitely doing it again next year. It absolutely brightened up my yard, spring, summer, and fall. I had fish breeding outside. I propagated a whole lot of plants. I didn't even start the plants. They're, get they're getting a little hydrogen peroxide dip right now. I'm very, I feel very blessed with these summer tubs. They're, they're great. And now I'm going to wash them out and I'm going to bring one of them inside for my painted turtle so he can live inside. summer tubbing. Till next year.